I'm Brian Altano, and this is IGN News. Damon's out of town on assignment, so I'll be bringing you this crazy ass news story. In the true spirit of the holidays and all things Grinchy, we have what could be the biggest holiday heist we've ever heard of. Last weekend in Seattle, Washington, at the SeaTac International Airport, a real deal Goodfellas style caper took place. We just found out the contents of the stolen merchandise, and thieves made off with 7,000 Wii U consoles, totaling over $2 million in value. Sergeant Cindy West told ABC News, I've been a cop for 28 years and I've never seen anything like this. This has come straight out of the movies. And she's right. A caper like this couldn't be an easy task. Thieves drove two large diesel trucks into a Nintendo distribution center inside an air cargo warehouse. They then worked together and used warehouse forklifts to load the consoles into two 53-foot semi-truck trailers that had been waiting outside the warehouse along with a smaller box truck. The trucks were expected to have been ditched, however, they've yet to be found. Sergeant West added, if we don't get any tips ahead of time, it will be the selling of these consoles that will lead to their capture. It's gonna be pretty hard to hide 7,000 Wii game consoles. We'll keep you updated as this story develops. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and for all your Nintendo news, keep it locked to IGN.